Hey everybody, it's Karen from Our Fall Clicks. I'm actually getting ready to film a pour, but before I do, I thought I'd do another quick snippet. It's another one, resin related. Um, when you resin, check out my resin video number 65, by the way, if you're new to uh, um, using resin, I have an hour long video with lots of tips and tricks for you to check out. One of the best things you can use as a measuring cup are these OXO, OXO, silicon measuring cups. Resin doesn't like silicon at all. You don't have to buy one of these though. These quart size cups from any hardware store work equally as well. And even though they're plastic, resin doesn't like plastic either. Now I've gone ahead and cheated a little bit. So what happens is I resin, um, I leave a little bit, and usually I have a stick, but there was barely anything left in this one. And you just wait three or four days. Crack, 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 crackity, crack, crack, crack. And then what you can do, and this one I did cheat because this came out already. That's around the edge, garbage. And then what happens is the resin starts to peel away from the plastic. You can see it right there. And you can just kind of go around the edges and give it a tug. And then put your hand all the way in deep to grab it. And give it a tug. This comes out. This is clean, ready to use again. So that's my uh, snippet for the day. And uh, I'm going to go film. See you later. Bye.